while I was browsing Amazon one day, I found a book. This book that I found is this one right here. It's called The Art Teacher is Weird, and it's based on a true story, and it's written and illustrated by some guy named Jeff, uh, Jeff Schmidt. Schmidt. Um, and I, I had to get it uh, based on my uh, occupation, which is an art teacher, it's my career. And uh, I was just really curious. There was like no images online of what this book was. I looked on Google. There was nothing I could tell about this book. So I have no idea what this book was about when I bought it. It was cheap. Um, if you guys want to take a look of uh, where to get it, it's just on Amazon. That's where I got it from. But um, I want to read this book to you and I based a project off of this. I think you guys will enjoy it. Based on a true story. Which is just weird. Oh, this is so cool. Cincinnati, Ohio has some bread, a baseball bat, looks like a horseshoe, paintbrush, light bulb, and tie. A kite. It's really cool. Alright, have you seen our new art teacher? He's strange to say the least. I've met him personally, but the other kids call him Beast. Look at that. Ooh. Travis said he has tentacles, and Garrett said so too. They both heard it from Sam and Kim, so I guess it must be true. Margaret said his teeth are huge, as sharp as she's ever seen. Angel said he has a yellow tongue, squirming about in between. My teeth look like that. <laughs> Carly tried to sneak a peek through the window in the door. She said she thought he might be blue, but she couldn't be totally sure. Is that you guys looking through the, my window? <laughs> Terry told me he has big horns. They grow right out of his head. Jackson said he has a tail striped with gold and red. Betty swore he was an alien who came from beyond the stars as proof she shared this photo of him jumping around on Mars. It's possible he's a monster and a very odd one, no lie. To pretend he's one of us, he always rocks a tie. I don't rock a tie. Long story short, I got paint on an expensive tie. Never again. <laughs> I finally got to meet him on my very first day of art. I have to say it's a lot of things that set this guy apart. Did I read that right? <laughs> He's got two big horns and a tail, and his skin's as blue as the sky. Can he really be our teacher? I just can't believe my eyes. Is that how you guys look at me? He draws with his teeth and he cuts with his toes. I'm processing what's going on right now, so forgive me. He sculpts with his tail and keeps paint up his nose. <laughs> oh jeez, should I dance like that for more often when you guys get back? He could walk around the room, but he chooses to dance instead. And once he spent an entire week singing everything he said. If you're paying close attention to his face each time he speaks, you'll see his eyes get wider and different colors in his cheeks. Oh gosh. I used to think Mrs. Diddle was the weirdest teacher in town. And really, she probably was until this one came around. He truly is as strange as all the other kids say, but still, he comes to school each and every day. He's not what you'd call normal, but really, who's to say? In art, you got to be yourself, and I think that's okay. A Brief History of Pickles by Chicken McDonough, is that what he's reading? <laughs> Interesting. I've, I don't look anything like that, but can you imagine? All right, anyways, that was the book. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I have a fun project with you guys. So it says Art Teacher is Weird by Jeff Smith. I don't want to take credit for his uh, weird project or his weird uh, book, but um, I want to create a lesson off of it. What I'm gonna do, is I'm going to draw me, basically. So you're gonna draw an art teacher. I have a big head. My head's super big, woo! All right, big head. I'm at least gonna draw my ears, round ears. This weird hole in my ear. There you go. All right, I got... Go. Here, all done. All right, these weird sideburns. Goes all the way up, all the way down. Okay. Yeah, 
here it sticks up sometimes. There we go. Unwrecked. Create cheeks. My chin, my big nose. I got a big nose, guys. It's flat too. I'm gonna create this lid down here, and down here for my eyes. Ciao. And then what I'm gonna do here, okay, you guys can see. I'm gonna draw my rectangular eyebrows, big isosceles triangles. Here we go. Oh, oh. That way I look kind of like me. I was born with isosceles triangles. I have no idea why. <laughs> it's hereditary, I guess. Genetics. I look permanently mad. All right, so I'm gonna draw my eyes looking this way. Go. There's one eye. Here's two eyes. Here's the second one. All right. I'm gonna leave my mouth blank. That's for you guys to decide. Um, I am gonna draw a little bit of body on the bottom. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw a sleeve here, draw my hand. It's going to be really basic. It's going to look like an Animal Crossing kind of character with no fingers. <laughs> there you go. Big belly. Big belly. There we go. All right. Draw my pants. My pants short so I don't run off the page, unfortunately. And I'm gonna draw my shows. Chuck shoes, there you go. And ta da! I think that's pretty good. Make sure you guys include a mouth. So what I want you guys to do, add anything you want. I'm gonna give you guys a couple ideas. Um, so in this book, look at this crazy character right here. Look at this. He's got horns. He's got a crazy tail, big shoes. He's got tentacle, four arms. He's got a beak. Uh, what I want you guys to do, using this template right here of me, I want you guys to create like the most weirdest art teacher you've ever seen. Um, so. It's, it's gonna be really weird. I hope you guys enjoy it. So, um, enjoy. <laughs> Can't wait to see you guys, what you guys come up with. So, uh, anyways, hope you guys enjoy the video. See you guys in the next one. Oh, I forgot, the link in, is in below. So if you guys want a copy of this and draw me, you can. <laughs>